You lied. Good morning. This is Rob. Here's your truck. Okay. It's a yucky rainy day here in Cambridge. I'm at the Mac dealer. So I'll uh, take you over here. Open the hood. Okay, so we got a brand new set of steer tires, Aeolus, ASL 67, MP8, 485 horsepower. You can see that on the sticker. You got a brand new alternator on there. Underside of the hood looks clean. I don't see any evidence of having been repainted or anything like that. Okay, firewall and everything looks decent. Come around the other side. New steering tires. This thing looks like it has a new EGR cooler put on it at some point. Okay, you can see under the hood, it all seems to be in decent shape. Now the bumper's got a little bit of a bend in it. I'll show you that in a minute. Let me just quickly check the oil level for you. Okay. So you can see, oops, oil levels up. I'll put the phone here. See, looks decent, doesn't look watery or anything funny going on in there. And the level's okay. Uh, if you look here, you're gonna see the wiring harness that they changed. It's all that plug there, that's all brand new. That's what they were doing yesterday. They changed all this stuff is all brand new. This is what they ended up having to change. They said it was like an eight hour job. And I see this clamp is loose here. I'm gonna get them to tighten that up. That probably had to come out when they were, uh, when they were working on it. I'll just check the other side and see what the deal is here. Okay, so we've got, um, I don't know if I see any of that new harness. I do see some of the harness here. This all looks new. You can see new stuff here. This is new. All that's new. So that was what was changed. I'll take you around the side here. You'll see there's no um, no body damage. We've got a uh, little bit of corrosion going on. Actually, there's a little bit of a gouge in the tank here. Uh, we've got the APU, carrier APU unit. I don't know if it works. Uh, we've got the tires on the back here. You got a Holland sliding fifth wheel. That's a good one, the 3500. Uh, these are recap tires. They're probably 40, 50%. Okay. Get you a good look at the back of the truck. Okay. Uh, looks like the shocks were put on not that long ago. Uh, we got aluminum wheels on the outside. We got steel wheels on the inside differentials this is a uh, uh, like I said that's a 390 this looks like a Mac axle based on where the uh, where the pinions coming out of the back brakes I can't tell oh wait uh, brakes look they got some meat on them there you got probably half an inch of shoe okay uh, on this side there's no damage a little bit of corrosion going on on the piece here. Uh, this other truck beside is puking oil everywhere. I'm walking through it. Um, okay, so let me get the key. Uh, my hand is all covered in oil. I'm gonna put the phone down and clean my hand off for half a second. Okay, my hand is still covered in oil, but it's better. Okay, so uh, here's your seat that I was talking to you about. Doesn't look great. The other seat's kind of screwed up too. Okay, so we've got, uh, let's see here. Hang on, 
get it started. See how it starts. That was what they were checking this morning. There we go. She runs good. Okay, so I'll take you through the cab. Let me let this thing air up. So you got air conditioning, which I checked and it works. Um, you've got uh, engine brake, heated mirrors, power heated mirrors, power mirrors, engine brake, traction control, cruise. Uh, you got your locking differential, your power locks, your right hand power mirror. Uh, you've got tilt, and we've got uh, 1,100 kilometers. We're low on fuel, I guess we gotta put a little bit in. And, oops, falling down here. Let me turn on some lights in the back. How do we do that? There we go, there we go. Okay, so we've got the light there, we've got the carrier control unit, we've got your heat, air conditioning, and there's no fridge in this truck. Uh, you've got a compartment there that looks like there might have been one, or at least there's a plug for one. Um, and you've got a storage car compartment. Uh, as far as the um, uh, the storage up top, you got quite a bit here, you can see. And you've got your windows. I'll open that up, get you to have a look. It's in good shape. Um, what else have we got? We got the other window. That's in good shape. Uh, I'm going to try and turn on the carrier unit and see if that actually works. Try it. APU on. APU starting. Let's see what it does. I don't know if it works. If it works, it's a bonus. Please wait. APU starting. Now, when I drove this truck, the clutch felt really good. It went through all the gears. Oh yeah, I hear it coming on. So, um, sounds like it's working. I hear it running and starting. That's always a bonus. Let me shut the truck off. And we'll see if we can get any kind of heat to come out of this thing. Hang on one second. Okay, so you can probably hear the APU running. Um, now let's see if I can put it on heat. Heat low, heat high. See what it does. 10,000 hours on the APU unit. I'm trying to see if I can feel air coming out. I'm not sure which vent it actually blows out of. Hang on. Oh, it's coming out over here. I can hear it. Oh, it's coming out over here. So this is blowing nice. This is blowing at me. There's air coming out of that. That's cool. That's in heat mode. And it's also blowing out over here. Man, this thing's blowing like crazy. It's got a ton of, and I can feel hot air coming out of it right now. It's not super hot, but it's actually, it's not cold. It's definitely warmer than the air in the cab. So that's lovely. Um, here's your truck, man. I'll give you a good, good view from the back. Okay, so I'm going to put this up on YouTube. You take a look and uh, I'll send you an agreement shortly. Thanks, brother. Bye for now.